Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and it is the most magical time of the year. No, no, not New Year's and uh, no, no, definitely not Christmas. Christmas is long gone. That is why my Christmas tree is over there for the rest of the year. So yeah, no New Year's, no Christmas. This is all about my annual Let's Play of Fable. I've been doing this for like four years now, <laughs> trying to really complete the game. I don't know how far I can get. I don't know how many more years this is gonna take me, but let's jump right in. Back down you come. I need you to make funny jokes like this oh, one. Ragnarok. Did we do something funny? Yeah, <laughs> please, please like the video. That must have been hilarious. Ah! Okay, here we go. I was just... Oh, what? <laughs> do you see his mouth just blabbering away like a fish? What? Why are you all making fun of me? All right, that's it. I've been holding that in for a year. <laughs> I'll be on my way now. Oh, hero title vendor. What? What is my hero name? I've forgotten. Sorry, my memory isn't as good as it used to be. I don't remember what I called myself in Fable a year ago. <laughs> my name is Deathbringer, but I'm not really that kind of person anymore. I've changed a lot. You know, I've made a New Year's resolution here to be a better person. I'm going to go with Reaper. That sounds kind of family friendly to me. Whisper is dead. Oh yeah, I forgot I killed my childhood friend <laughs> thank you for catching me up i feel like i needed a last time on kevin's fable let's play i've brought up the map and i don't know how to get rid of it i didn't even know you could do this on this game all right well i guess i have to live with it this is the rest of the video folks oh no there's feckin balverines these ruined my last two episodes they've made it so difficult oh wait a second the npcs are after running into them oh thank goodness now i can just run right on by 2021 is off to a fantastic start i gotta say why am i wearing all this armor i thought i was wearing some much cooler clothes last time let's say kevin just keep clicking all the keys something's gonna bring up your inventory it's gotta be here somewhere uh, it's not that one has <laughs> used the health potion i think uh, i did it again somehow <laughs> enter okay it's enter i got it now that's more like it that is cool look at that dress i'd feel so free wearing that and you know what i think i'll get a tattoo i think i've earned it i'm surprised you didn't go out of business since you didn't have a customer in a year the only place i have tattooed is my legs and that's the only place i'm actually wearing clothing what's the most generic tattoo like the kind of tattoo you go into the store and it would be the first one in the book <laughs> okay that one's an absolute mess let me buy that one yeah there we go okay awesome Thank you very much for watching me. I appreciate it. <laughs> it means a lot that you watch my content. Heroic verse for sir, of course. Are you talking to me or, or you are talking to me? Okay, you were looking at the wall. <laughs> it's okay if you're just a bit socially awkward. I'm, I'm totally fine with that. I'm looking deep into you. This is deep. uncomfortable. Ah, sir is complex. I'm really not. I'm the most one-dimensional character ever. I'm just stereotypically evil. Okay, um, he's saying a quick line about me slaughtering people at a farm, and now everyone in the bar is leaving. <laughs> Guys, please, someone stay. <laughs> Anyone. Tire nose. Okay, I do not believe <laughs> that excuse. Say, like, oh, we've all just decided we're all tired at the same time. We're all going home now. <laughs> right, you know what? Let's head to our destination. We need to go to the gray house. I mean, that could be any house. There's a lot of gray houses. Neutrals are so in right now. All right, I need to get to Willow Fields. Is that where it says? I don't know how to use a map. It's feckin' 2021, okay? We don't use maps anymore. Barrow Fields. Okay, Barrow Fields. Yeah, yeah, go, go there. That's fine. All right, I'm here at the gray house. I, this looks like I'm about to be murdered. Jack's creatures are still after him. Just like they're after me. I, I zoned out for a bit there. Were you talking about Jack Jacksepticeye? I'll do anything to save Jack Jacksepticeye. <laughs> the man is a national treasure. <laughs> what what house is this? I don't remember this in the game at all. Is this turned into a horror movie all of a sudden? I literally do not remember this. Have I repressed it? If I have, maybe some really bad stuff is about to go down. Okay, no, it's just some goofy monster. <laughs> Never mind. I thought this was actually going to be scary. Honestly, this is a reward, if anything. I love tormenting the dead. It's a great time. I think this is just like one of my Sims houses. Houses. I just found instructions in that bookcase how to make a normal beard. <laughs> God, I wish I could find that in real life. It's just so fair here. It doesn't really, it doesn't show. Like, there is actually, like, some hair here, I promise. Look, I'm pulling on my skin. You see that? That's kind of cool. Wow. Please like and subscribe. The grave says, I finished before you in the human race. <laughs> 
<laughs> I like that. Going out with a joke. This grave says, let me out. Okay, that's just weird. I'm running away. But not before I dance on your grave. <laughs> All right, now I'm running away. I don't know why she wanted to meet me here. This place seemed to have no relevance to the conversation at all. Can I just go back to the guild? This was just a waste of my time, to be honest with you. All right, what do we got here? Rescue the archaeologist from the jail. <gasps> Tonight, there's going to be a jailbreak. Take quest and boast. Hello, everyone. I'm here to announce that I'm rescuing the archaeologist. Um, naked. <laughs> and they're just like, please, no, we, no one wants that. And I'm like, yes, everyone. I will be naked. <laughs> and no, please, actually, could you really not do that? There are kids completely naked. <laughs> oh, wait, this guy had way better titles. I want to be arse face. I'm just holding this head. I'm just, well, I'm trying to get naked. What? Uh, hold on. Let me get undressed, everyone. Then you can cheer again. Yeah. Yay, everyone's happy. Oh my god, my legs are destroyed. Here I come. I'm going to do the quest naked. And the guy's just like, excuse me, who are you? Oh, hello there. Oh, yes. You're well known enough to come in. Okay. <laughs> I'm running in naked, but if I'm well known enough to come in, I guess that's fine. No dress code, just a renowned code. We have a raving lunatic locked up right now, but he won't be seeing many more sunrises, if you know what I mean. Why are you telling this random person this? Like, I just ran into the town naked, and he's like, we're a very dangerous person locked up in the jail cells. Like, if you are planning on breaking him out, you should do it quick, because he's gonna die soon. All right, what do we got here? Where are the jail cells? Over here. I can break you out, buddy. Don't worry. I'll bend the bars with my own arms. I'm that strong. <laughs> now, do you actually have a key or something? Because I don't really have any skills. And these bars actually remind me of myself. They're super thick. Do you want to help the prisoner investigate the death of Lady Grace's sister? <laughs> I mean, not really. <laughs> can I say no? Don't tell me they've got to you as well. I knew she was using some sort of spell to turn all heroes into half-wits. No, I was a half-wit to begin with. Can I skip this? <laughs> I don't want to help you. I'm not crazy. I just walked away from him. I'll see if I can do it another way. <laughs> they grabbed the archaeologist and took him up the hill there. Oh, wait, that wasn't even the archaeologist. That was just some poor person in need. Oh, thank God I didn't help him. What the hell is this? I don't remember this. You've got to rescue him. But he's his own guard. He's paid for this. I'm just some naked dude that showed up on the bridge. I'm right behind you. Well, get in front of me, because I'm not going in there first. All right, fine. You know what? You want to play chicken like this? I'll just let him die. <laughs> now he's dead. Are you happy? Now you'll fight, huh? Well, I'm running by. <laughs> Take his money. <laughs> Wait, I'm only using my fists. How do I... Okay, I died immediately. Ho hold on. Give me a second, guys. There's so much going on here. I'm gonna die again. Oh my god. <laughs> I died twice already. Maybe running past everything wasn't the best idea? Okay, wait. I got I got the main guy. Hold on. Oh god, there's so many of you. Hold on, hold on. Let me out, let me out, let me out. <laughs> Okay, that's my third death in this house. I'm leaving. The place is haunted. Was that worth it? <laughs> Dying three times and losing three of my revives when I only had six? Uh, probably not worth it. No. <laughs> oh, no. He's summoning feckin' Malphite out of League of Legends. This game's about to get toxic. There's a guard over there. I can see you just standing there. Oh, my God. Oh my god, oh my god, I'm gonna die loads of times again. Why did I decide to do this naked? This was a horrible idea. Why would you make me do this? Oh my god, I've died again. Hold on, I'm putting on my clothes. Oh, the people are gonna be so disappointed. Stop spawn killing me. Okay, now I'm all dressed up. Okay, they're all dead, but I lost all my revives. And I'm so embarrassed for putting on clothes. Wait, where did you guys come from? Now you wanna help me? Jesus. God, this Claude bandana really hides my horns. Prison path. Okay, this looks like where the prison ends. Thankfully, I, I should be able to save them here, right? There he is. Okay. Why do they want him? I don't understand what's even happening here. The guy's an archaeologist. All right, I'm gonna try the old run past everyone strategy because frankly, even attempting to fight them has ended with me dying like seven times. Please just go into a cutscene. Please go into a cutscene. Please go into a cutscene. Oh no. No, I can't interact with him. Yeah, whoops indeed. Behind me, yeah, I know, I, I have noticed there is literally an army following me. Let's get them! Yeah, let's, why don't you do something, huh? And the bright side, I'm dying a lot less now that I'm actually wearing clothes. And you know what? I'm starting to realize why I repressed this whole thing, because I legit do not remember any of this. <laughs> you saved me. 
Oh my god, what is this? Jesus Christ. Oh my eyes. Oh, that was awful. Oh, stop it. There's an ancient route into the prison through the Litchfield graveyard. Wait, I don't want to go to the prison. Why am I going to the prison? Oh yeah, I need to save my mom or something. I forgot about that. Don't really like her that much. All right, I got a minion helmet. I didn't do the quest naked, unfortunately. <laughs> I lost a lot from that. In fact, I lost everything because I, I lost my dignity by starting the bloody thing. And then I lost my pride and my money by putting clothes on after fucking giving up. Oh, for feck's sake, it's the undead again. Get a life. All right, poor choice of words, but just leave me alone. Why are all of you hanging out at the graveyard? What? What is this? This is ridiculous. You have a house set that must be worth a bleeding fortune. Yeah, I smashed open the crypt and it was all just lying. Uh, what are you talking about? Why are you saying this in front of me? Like, I know I'm turned the other way, but I'm clearly eavesdropping. Shh. What was that? <laughs> He's realized. Dude, I'm like three feet away from you. I just needed somewhere to sleep. <laughs> like, I even waved as he walked away. <laughs> oh, sorry. Dude, I, I didn't actually mean to do that. A spade. Nice. You found a spade. Use it to dig for treasure antiques and decomposing bodies. Yay. Now, the secret's buried with him in his crypt. Crypt. I like the way he talks. Wait, is he coming with me? He doesn't seem like the brave type. The undead are rising. Yeah, yeah, they sure are. You just walked into that, man. I don't think you can even blame him. Is there any convenience store in this graveyard? I need some health potions, like quite urgently, actually. Maybe there's one in this crypt. Mm, any store in here? Oh my god, I thought that skeleton was wearing sunglasses. I was like, this guy's cool. Okay, I gotta gather all his stuff. Uh, dude, you're dying. Is he dead? He's just lying there. I think he's dead. <laughs> well, at least he's already in a crypt. It saves a lot of legwork for me. How do I fish? I have no fishing rod. You think it would tell me beforehand, but no. Right, let's see, where could I buy stuff? Three general shops. There we go. Let's go there. Hopefully I can buy a fishing rod. Just what was that? Oh, he's, he dropped everything he was holding to warn the children about me. If I can't kick the children, I'll kick the chickens. Oh, I found all the children. Okay. Oh, it doesn't let me attack them. Um, see ya. Oh, wait, it did. Yes. Okay, good job. Not quite as brutal as Fallout allows you to be. Fire in the hole. Hello, <laughs> forgive me. I just beat up one of the kids. Oh, look. How to make friends. Yeah, no worries. I wasn't going to read it anyway. Today's lesson will be... Oh, wait, he's actually going to read it to me. I wish like I was just sitting down on one of the little tables. Can anybody tell me another way to make friends? Oh, 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 not hitting children. <laughs> Always good to help the community. Now, where is the store? I need a fishing rod. Stupid chicken, ah! tell me where the store is. Oh, wait, is this the general store? Rubbish. Be feckin' careful who you say rubbish to. <laughs> doll of you. Oh, yeah, buy all of those. I am a narcissist. Now I can say my doll sold out and sure I bought it myself, but I'll just omit that piece of the information. On oh, fishing rod. Perfect. Got weird birds in the area. <laughs> I think that was a bandit behind me, but I'm just going to refuse to acknowledge it. I don't want to fight anyone. All right, I'm back. And that means you get a second chance at life, my friend. Oh, well, you wasted your second chance at life. I'm going to do some fishing. This is pretty peaceful, actually. Fishing for armor in a graveyard at night. All the undead behind me just watching. Yay, fish. All right, I caught a shield. I don't know how that bit onto my hook, but oh well, I'm happy. <laughs> Digging up a grave and then just laughing like, ha ha ha. Oh, so funny. And he left the last just on his fireplace. Wow, that was easy. That was probably him by the door trying to come back and stop me. There we go. We dressed you up. Aren't you all pretty now? Thank you, Jesus. You scratch my back, I'll scratch yours. He's gonna open a door for me now, apparently. There we go. Now we get to go inside. I don't even know what's in here. This is just the main quest. I'm just kind of following along. Um, what was it? I went to the lady's house and the, the archaeologist and he said that there's a path. I, I don't know. Let's just keep going. Oh, do I have to kill this dude? I kind of ran past most of the dead. I'm just a really nice person and I don't, I don't want to bother them. Like, they've suffered enough. No, I'm just kind of lazy. I don't want to fight. 
Okay, there we go. He's dead. Now, yay, the door will open now. <laughs> Good thing I only have to kill that one and I can run from the rest. Excuse me. Oh, god damn it. Now my clothes are all dirty. You see, this is why I should be naked. Circle of the dead. Sounds like my kind of place. Wait, where is this going now? Underground chamber. I don't know if I want to go down there. I kind of want to just go find a wife. Oh, yeah. Uh, this is the prison break mission. You know what? I'm going to leave that till next year. <laughs> god, talk about kicking the can down the road. I'm going to go get married. How much is this house? 1,500 gold? I have plenty for that. Yeah, rent out this marital home. No, I want to live in it. Improve for 500 gold. How much gold do I even have? I have 25,000. Yes. All right, there we go. It's the perfect decor now. Now you can't help but marry me, even though I have twin beds. <laughs> That's fine. Look at that. The place even has a view. Like, not a good view, but a view nonetheless. <gasps> oh, we're, we're most pleased to see you again, sir. Yeah, do you like my flirting? Come on, I can buy your love. Now I will buy you anything if it'll mean you'll be my wife. <laughs> I mean, I do have a lot of money in the game, so that might be my best strategy. My guy is not the most attractive or nice of gentlemen. In fact, he has nothing at all going for him, other than the fact he has money. The witch in Bowerstone Key is the only one who can cure him? Oh yeah, I told you I'd help cure your kid. No, I don't want anyone with baggage. I'll find someone else. Sorry, I thought you were just a normal NPC. What's the most attractive thing I could get for, for my person right now? Um, Apparently a power mustache. Okay, give me a power mustache. How does that look? Great. That looks awesome. <laughs> now no one will be able to resist. Oops. What? All right, hold on. Let me try and change my clothes too. Okay, apparently this is the most attractive outfit I have. Wow, that is just depressing, honestly. Arseface. Oh yeah, and my name is Arseface. Wait, this person kind of likes me. Sure, she's married with kids, but the dad can take care of the kid. Arseface. Stop, wait, well, your love for me is growing. Okay, keep calling me Arseface then. Yeah, keep going, keep going. Mm, tall and strong, aren't you? <laughs> she's loving it. The mustache works. I'm going to grow one of those mustaches if everyone loves them that much. Will you marry me? <laughs> <laughs> right in front of the teacher. That's the teacher of the school children. And I just proposed to his wife. Okay, are we gonna, you're gonna follow me now? Do I take you to my home? I don't understand. Are you with me now? Are we an item? Look at my guy. <laughs> he looks like he'd be in a bad cartoon. He's like a villain that's turned over a new leaf or something. I reckon we should tie the knot. Okay, yeah, sure. <laughs> and it's as easy as that. What the hell? That was so easy. And so the hero married. And so the hero married. It's just kind of jammed in there in the story. That's a whole chapter. <laughs> just that one line. Okay, whoever painted that did me a lot of favors. Like, they gave me a lot of extra hair and they blanked out the rest of my face. So you couldn't see how ugly I am. I got 250 gold for this. I'm the luckiest girl in Albion to have married you. Yeah, you're so lucky. <laughs> you're literally the first person I stumbled upon that actually had a heart over their heads. Just a giant poo. What? I will beat the bejesus out of you. <laughs> You're lucky my wife is standing right over there. <laughs> Why are children so cruel? Oh, look, everyone loves me now. I always believed you'd return. <laughs> Yesterday you were cowering from me. Follow, please. Sure. Okay, she's following me. Let's go to a different place and see if I can marry you too. Fake wedding ring? Would that do it? My guy is so damn attractive, it would probably work. Buy two of them. The archaeologist has been in prison. She was standing right there. <laughs> I was just like, I'll take two fake wedding rings. It's worrying that they're fake and it's worrying that I bought two. Oh, she didn't follow me. I think I'd have to walk all the way with her. Well, that's not what I'm going to do. I'm just going to find someone else. Hello, do you like me? Oh, look, it's it's growing. I'm just standing here doing nothing. God, it must be good to be this attractive. Why don't we meet up sometime? <laughs> My guy is literally not even saying anything. He's just staring. <laughs> it might as well be a cardboard cutout. And you can see it in the distance. Their hearts are growing too. It's a Christmas miracle. And on this day, all the villagers' hearts grew 15 times their size for me. Two words. Wedding ring. Okay, Jesus, she's keen. Could it be three words, though? Fake wedding ring? Would that do? Yeah, I'm really not getting this, because this is really not, like, funny. Okay, she does not like a fake ring. Hold on, let me go get a real one. I could just die. <laughs> <laughs> that person's still living in 2020. Okay, I got an actual wedding ring now. It's actually more convenient to just marry you since you're here. Hey, want to marry me, person I never met? Just say yes. Follow. <laughs> That's the only thing he's ever said to her. Just follow. Oh my God, this thing was 9,000? And improving the decor is four grand. Oh no, we're going to be like a floor family. I'd like to be your wife. 
That's great. <laughs> yeah, let's get married. Perfect. And so the hero married. <laughs> People reading this book are gonna think it's a printing error. <laughs> Two chapters in a row with just that line. And she'll never see me again. <laughs> it's just running away. Horrible sod, that one. Why do none of the men want to marry my guy? I think I did some sort of slaughtering here or something. <laughs> this little scream. <laughs> hey. What was that? He doesn't like me flirting. What is wrong with him? All right, fine. I'll go steal one of your wives then. Literally will take my pick. <laughs> All right, I'll just go into the neighbor's house. Uh, is there someone here? Oh, yeah. Look, you already love me. Here, you want to marry? <laughs> of course you do. Follow me. I just walked into the house with a wedding ring and I went, follow. You're the man I'm going to marry. Yep, the man you met literally 10 seconds ago across the street and got married. And for the third time in a row, the chapter says, And so the hero married. All right, you know what? That is a good place to end it for this year. Three wives. He's going to settle down for a year and just have a happy life until we come back and ruin it a bit more next year. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy my stuff, I post every day. I hope to see you next time, folks. Thank you. Bye for now.